My name is Howard Tolman. I'm the CEO of 1871. We're honored and pleased today to have a group of people that we've worked with closely over many, many years, including uh, one of our favorite uh, clerks, uh, who will be speaking to you in just a few minutes. But right now, I just want to take a moment to introduce Seamus, and he will explain what we're doing here today and give you sort of a, an overview of this uh, new and very exciting initiative. We think that the more that we can do to introduce kids to coding and to the methodology and to the thought processes around the development of code, and to combine that specifically with the development of laws is a really exciting opportunity for the city and one that's going to be a powerful example for the whole rest of the country. So Seamus, please. Howard. Right. Thank you guys. Hey guys, good afternoon. I'd like to welcome everybody to the launch of Envision Chicago. It's a new, a new initiative for the internet age, but one that's based on very, very old principles here in Chicago. That in order to have a healthy democracy and a thriving community, we must educate and engage with the next generation of our city's leaders. We must set a strong example for how city government should work. And we must recognize that the best ideas can come from anywhere and that they must be brought before the city council for consideration. Now, it's never been easy to make this stuff happen, democracy. It is, as Winston Churchill said, the worst form of government, except for all the other ones. <laughs> but as technology and the internet are improving our personal lives and our work lives, we need to bring that power and that promise to our civic lives. That's what we do here at the Open Gov Foundation, the nonprofit I have the great good fortune to lead. My name is Seamus Craft, and together with these amazing leaders behind me, and our incredible supporters with some talented teachers in Chicago's public schools. Uh, we're here to send a clear message to young Chicagoans. It's time to start sharing your ideas. It's our time to listen to you and engage with you and bring municipal government into the digital age. Now thank you, 1871 and Howard, uh, for having us here today. Uh, if you don't know, Howard has done as much, if not more, than anyone else in the city to bring local startups to this place and attract international and national innovators, entrepreneurs, and internet age dreamers. Thank you. Um, so Envision Chicago is launching today in four wards, in four amazing high schools and with four amazing aldermen. So thanks to the Marine Leadership Academy at Ames in Ward 26, to the Chicago Excel Academy in Roseland in Ward 34, to the Taft High School in Ward 41, and to Lakeview High School in Ward 47, represented here, by Kristen Hu, and by some of her amazing students. You wave and recognize you're what this is all about. You guys rock, thanks for coming. Um, now, Vision Chicago would not be possible without the help and encouragement of our community-based supporters. Thank you, Microsoft Chicago. Thanks, Adam. Smart Chicago Collaborative, Haymarket, and ComEd for sponsoring these scholarships. Thank you to Comcast for generally, generously donating free internet access for so many students in the city. And thank you to the Chicago Public Library, Commissioner Brian Bannon, and the awesome folks at the Mikva Challenge for lending us your support and welcoming us to this hometown. But I, another big thanks I need to give to the intrepid, innovative, and awesome aldermen here with us today. Chairman Austin, Alderman Napolitano, Alderman Maldonado, and Alderman Poir, thank you for standing with young Chicagoans, for helping to bring the city council into the digital age and for showing elected officials everywhere that there can be a better way to engage with your citizens. But I want to give a special thanks to the woman right behind me, to the city official who's the heart and soul of Envision Chicago, and who stands at the center of so many good government efforts in Chicago. The person who first brought me and the Open Gov Foundation into this community back in 2013, and the person who's welcomed us like true friends, true partners, and true family ever since, Clerk Susanna Mendoza. It seems that everything Clerk Mendoza touches gets better, cooler, and happier. From her world-class staff, hey guys, I see you, to the city sticker system, to the law itself you can now see opened in the internet age format at chicagocode.org. Now during this time of great political upheaval, some of which has visited our town today, and big time budgetary challenges in cities and states, Clerk Mendoza is a shining star She's always solving seemingly intractable problems and doing it with a smile. Oh, by the way, she's spearheading the creation of the first 21st century legislature anywhere in the world. 
Now, I spent a lot of time with a lot of elected officials, and there is no one in the world I'd rather have riding shotgun on this grand adventure to repair the critical infrastructure of Chicago City Council <coughs> so that it can become more efficient and effective and serve its citizens better. Come on up here, Coach Thank you. Thank you.